days, last time on Dragon Ball Z, we learned that Frieza was back, and we planned to make it up to the elders in order to form a plan to defeat the evil tyrant for all. Alright, so, yep, went back and saved, made it back here. Let's just go up here and see what happens. Oh, a few more starting enemies to face. Alright, there we go. Yeah, let's get this guy. Yep. This game takes it on you pretty easy, though. As you see, like, these, uh, first early <laughs> enemies are pretty easy to beat. So, you know, just, uh, which makes sense to get you used to the game. Oh, man, there was a save point right here. And I went back all the way last episode and saved. Oh, well, in between episodes, but, oh, well. Let's just see what happens here. Oh, man, we get some interesting music. Oh, we got some people here. We got, uh, looks like Krillin's here. Woohoo! Yamcha. Chaozu. Uh, what's down here, though? Dun, dun, dun. Found a strength capsule. Yeah, so, uh, when you find a game still tutorializing us a little bit here, but when you find a strength, endurance, or power capsule, you can use it within your items by pressing the A button. So using a capsule permanently raises the stats of the character you're playing. Yeah, and, you know, well, like I said, I'm not spoiling anything about this game, but, uh, we all know the plot of Dragon Ball Z, and I would use most of my capsules for Gohan. Just saying, just saying. Uh, you. I'm not a Pokemon. I'm Chiaotzu. Chiaotzu. I'm scared. Aren't you afraid, Gohan? Uh, kind of. I wish Goku was here. He always tells us, knows what to do. Oh. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Oh, there's Tien here. Um, <laughs> I really can't do a good Tien voice, but let's just read his dialogue. I've never felt any, anything anywhere close to the amount of power I'm sensing right now. I have a feeling this is only the tip of the iceberg. Anything else, Tien? When you're ready, head up to the cliff top. All right, Tien. Oh, oh, he's still talking. I still haven't forgotten what happened the last time I met Vegeta. Oh, oh he disgusts me. How can you stomach him? Oh, Tien, based. Tien is so based. <laughs> oh, I love you, Tien. Woohoo! Hey, bro! We're about to see some action. Hey, Krillin. What's up? Uh, anything else? I don't mean to alarm you, but I'm detecting two energies headed this way. Two. Two power levels? And both of them feel like Frieza. Who here just pictured Frieza's mom? It's time like this. I really wish Goku were here. Where are you, Goku? Yeah, good question. Uh, oh, oh, and we, this this seems like the real Krillin dialogue here. It's been nice knowing you, little buddy. We had some fun times together. <laughs> We're all gonna fucking die. <laughs> uh, Alright, Krillin. Bulma, what have you got to say? I came here to see Frieza, but Yamcha's mad at me. Wait, what? Uh, oh, there's Yamcha. Do you realize Frieza, will, what, what Frieza will do here when he finds you here? Oh, yeah, I remember in the abridged episode, Yamcha was, like, freaking out. He's like, oh, my God, oh, my God, what are you guys, oh, my God. <laughs> of course I do. He'll come down and blow up the planet, but I want to see him before he does. What's wrong with that? Besi uh, okay, Bulma, I hear he's kind of cute. What? Ha! It's amazing how every time you open your mouth, you prove you're an idiot, Bulma. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh... I missed seeing Fr Frieza while I was on Nemex. I'm not going to miss my chance again. Man, they have a lot of dialogue here. That Vegeta can be so rude sometimes. He's like a spoiled little kid. He's so used to getting what he wants. Hmm. Uh, right, okay, same thing. All right, Yamcha. Vegeta's so unpredictable, it's hard to tell what his motives are. He's done terrible things, but I guess I should be forgiving. That's what Goku would do, right? Right, right, Yamcha. You got the right attitude. Who does that Vegeta think he is? Just because he's a prince doesn't mean he can go around ruling everyone. Okay. You think Bulma still likes me? <laughs> oh man, what a question, you know, yeah, I'm sure what a loaded question. We were going out for a while, but lately she's been giving me the cold soldier. Well, buddy, it seems like you've already got your answer. So, uh, let's talk to Guar here. I'm terrified of Frieza, but I have to stick with Yamcha. True, he can't be trusted on his own. Yamcha might get yamcha <laughs> Goku shows up soon. Me too, Puar. Me too. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, Vegeta, what does the prince have to say? Hello, Gohan. So, Kakarot's failed after all. Frieza's still alive, and he's coming here. 
Uh, how do you know? Maybe it could be someone else. Oh, come on, Yamcha. I know. I make it my business to know. Unlike you. Hey, Vegeta. What? Triclops? Nice shirt. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Alright, anything else Vegeta got to say? I'd rather Frieza scouts didn't detect us because of your incessant jabbering. Oh, I love that line. I love that line, Vegeta. What else? Let's put an end to this pathetic whimpering and go fight Frieza before he finds us. Alright. Is the Bulma woman mad? The female species. Ah, what an enigma. <laughs> oh my god, I love this game. Uh, yeah, yeah, so he's back to... Okay, at some point they repeat their dialogue. Okay, I don't know if I can save after all that, but all that dialogue was hilarious. So, uh, <laughs> let's, let's go back and save. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was great. That was great. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, I really just wanted to check out some of the dialogue and like Vegeta's was obviously pretty hilarious <laughs> Anyway, here's Piccolo. Oh Okay, obviously things happen when Piccolo's here. All right. Is everyone here? Good Ah, Just over that ridge to the north is the place where Frieza will be touching down Are You sure Vegeta? Yes, I'm sure. Now shut up. Now sip it. Oh, he basically said that. That's funny. I don't want him to know we're waiting. As soon as you're ready to fight Frieza, head over the ridge. I won't mince words here. Odds are, without Goku here, none of us will survive fighting Frieza. But we have to try. To protect the Earth. Uh, anything else you got to say, Piccolo? Unless we stop Frieza right here and now, we might as well kiss this entire planet goodbye. Yeah, pretty much, bro. This planet has been my home for a long time. Oh, okay. Even though I'm anemic, I feel like I belong here. Yeah, yeah. Well said, Piccolo. This is no time for petty bickering. Oh, okay, okay. Piccolo's back to saying what he usually says, so... Alright, up we go. But obviously, as we know from the storyline, we don't actually have to do anything here, do we? Let's go up here and see. Oh, and the music. Oh my god this game. I love that it has music from the actual, like, anime here. That, that that makes me love playing this game even more. But anyway. Yeah. It looks like Frieza and his father have landed on Earth. Hmm, so this is Earth. How droll, wouldn't you say, princess? How quaint. Ah, yes, daddy. How very quaint. Maybe we can find a circuit, 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 circuit city, or a best buy, 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 cadaverific. It's quite fitting that the Saiyan should call such a puny planet home. Hmm, wouldn't you say, princess? Honestly, Frieza, we could have finished this simply by destroying this awfully little planet from space. Ah, father, that would spoil all the fun. I plan to save up my revenge, jan, 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 or ranch, or inch. Every little bit. Ah. Uh, it's his fault that I have this cybernetic body. He humiliated me. Yes, and Frieza has gotten his upgrades, you know, from the cybernetic enhancements, as we know from the enemy. Uh, when, uh, when Goku returns home, he will find everything he has ever known or loved in ruins. They'll have to rename this planet Baron Wasteland. <laughs> he will know the wrath of Frieza. Ah, not that I don't just love it here, little Princess Frieza, but I still don't see why we sim can simply destroy this pathetic mud ball right now. Why, Father, it was you who taught me the fine art of revenge. Allow me to demonstrate by vaporizing all of the Saiyan's friends. One. One. And my, oh my, won't he be surprised when he returns home and finds no one here to welcome him, except for me. <laughs> Soldiers! Alright, and out the soldiers go. Uh, Frieza had a lot more soldiers than that, but I can understand, it's just a video game. No need to animate more than that. I want you to begin your search for the Saiyan's pathetic friends. 
<laughs> I, I remember in the abridged version, version they made a bunch of jokes about <laughs> if you find any full grown adult monkeys, you win. <laughs> and when you find them, show no mercy. Oh, and we get the awesome music. Here we go. Not so fast. You must be Freezer. Um, I am Lord Freezer, yes. Uh, well, wait, why is there an eye in it? There isn't. Oh. I've been waiting a long time to meet you face to face. Ah, we have a guest. Now, I'm going to destroy you. Oh, man. Oh, we better run. Isn't that right, Father? <laughs> you don't know what you're up against, boy. I know exactly what I'm up against, Frieza. And let me tell you, <laughs> I'm not worried. Oh, make no mistake. I'm going to finish you off once and for all. Who is this guy? His power's huge. His power level. His power level makes Frieza seem like nothing. Ha! Incredible! I've never sensed anything like this before. Where would someone with this kind of power have come from? Ah, if nothing else, I'd say this little creature is quite the comedian. Uh, enough joking around. You two are about to find out what it's like to fight against a real Super Saiyan warrior. And I'm not talking about Goku. <laughs> you what? You crack me up, kid. <laughs> and... He's gonna transform into a Super Saiyan. It's it's impossible. Those those eyes. Pizza. <laughs> ah, so this is a Super Saiyan. All you did was change your hair color. So what? And yeah, yeah, Trunks, you know, owns all the soldiers. Didn't use a sword though. That's interesting. Oh wait, did he just... Oh, oh yeah! Okay, okay, so he cut Frieza in half there. <laughs> a lot different than we saw in the anime, but you know. <laughs> you killed my princess! Oh well, you win some, you lose some. Ah, uh, children? Ah, Super Saiyan, I'm impressed to encounter a fighter of your calibers of Americans indeed. You see, I can appreciate a great talent such as yours. My eyes are not blinded by pride like my son's were. Join me and take Frieza's place at my side. I'll, I'll give you a planet. Uh, two planets? Three? Two and a half? You just went down. I'm a haggler? Not a chance. Very well. Let me see your stupid sword. If you won't join me, I'll destroy you. Can we actually fight here? Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, obviously these characters would be way overpowered for us at this point, so. All right, Frieza just, I mean, uh, Trunks just straight up takes him out. Like that, very easy. And he flies up to meet us. Hi, guys. I'm heading off to a place near here to meet Goku. Who the fuck's this guy? <laughs> Do you guys like to come? Weird, how does he know about my father? Right, Gohan? Just follow me. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! Good work, team! <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was weird. Uh, let's see what everyone has to say here. Uh, Krillin? Woohoo! Gosh, Gohan, this sure is mysterious. Who is this guy, and how does he know Goku? Uh, yeah, good question. You think this... You think Goku met this guy in space? Uh, I mean, anything's possible, I guess. Uh, oh, okay, same dialogue. Bulma, what have you got to say? There's something about this new guy that seems familiar. Hmm, I wonder. I just can't put my finger on it. I wonder if I know him. Okay. The stranger is wearing the Capsule Corporation logo. I've never seen him there. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Interesting, Bulma. What have you got to say, Yamcha? Sure glad that guy showed up and took care of Frieza. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, yeah, yeah. Scared out of your wits. Uh, same thing from Yancha. Okay, Piccolo. Oh, I'm sorry, Tien. I sure wouldn't want to fight this guy. There's a difference between bravery and stupidity. See, 
That's why I like Tien. He's smart. He's smart. At least so far, it seems like he's on our side. Yeah, yeah. Uh, right, right. Same thing. What about you, Chiaotzu? This guy is gonna... says he's gonna meet Goku. Maybe that means Goku's okay. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Alright, what about you, Piccolo? As uh, much as I like it, I guess we better follow this guy. I don't know if we can trust him. We have to do what we have to if we want to find out what's going on around here. All right, Vegeta, what about you? Ah, I don't know who he is, but he's no Super Saiyan. Uh, it's bad enough Goku's a Super Saiyan. You mean Kakarot? It's bad enough Kakarot's a Super Saiyan. But now there's another one that can't be true. Uh, yeah, uh, apparently it can be, and he is, so... I don't think we can talk to Puar, but let's get out of here. And hopefully we can find a save point. That was a lot of story dialogue, though. So... Okay, everyone's coming here. Uh, alright. Something gonna happen here. Uh... I guess we're free to talk to everyone again. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're all saying the same thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just making sure there's no new dialogue here. Uh... Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. What about you, Puar? Couldn't talk to you before. Do you know what's going on? I sure don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Just making sure there's no new dialogue there. Alright, Vegeta, what if you have to say? Same thing? Okay. Well, I guess we talked to this guy. Hello. Excuse me, mister. How do you know my dad? Actually, I haven't met your dad before. I just heard about him. Oh. Oh, then how do you know he's going to arrive at this spot? Well, that's, uh... Sorry, I can't say. Well, Mr. Can't Say, nice to meet you. Why not? I'll tell you. It's because you're up to something. Tell us now, tough guy. Who the hell are you? I wish I could say. Sorry. When you defeated Frieza and that other guy, you were a Super Saiyan, weren't you? A Super Duper Saiyan, yeah. Yes, I was. Ah, that's a lie. Kakarot, the one you call Goku, and myself are the only Saiyans left. Kakarot's kid is there is half Saiyan. So if you count him, that makes the three of us. There's no way you can have Saiyan blood. Uh, yeah, yeah. You make a good point there, Vegeta. No answer? Figures. Goku should be arriving any second now. Yeah, yeah. Way to change the subject there, Trunks. Here we go. We now meet the hero of the story. And now, their idiot rock has now become idiot crater. And Goku flies over here. Hey, Goku. I'm sure everyone's excited to see him. Hey, Dad. Welcome back to Earth, Goku. Yeah. Hey, guys. How'd you know I was going to be here? This guy told us I think he might be a fan of yours. He's a mystery man. He knows all about you, Daddy. Huh? But how? He knew the exact time and place of your arrival. Which is kind of strange. That's impossible. We've never even met. Must have been tracking your ship in outer space or something. That's the only logical conclusion. Really? Uh, hey, where's Frieza? Where's that Freezer anyway? I sense he was on his way here. I tried to get here as fast as I could. This guy defeated him. He turned into a Super Saiyan and picked him apart, Goku. Goku, can I have a word with you? Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, and they go off and do their little introduction, I guess. Sorry about all the secrecy, but I really need your word that you won't tell anyone about what I'm about to say. Well, sure. I've never had a problem keeping secrets. Uh, you have my word. My name's Trunks. It's gonna sound really strange, but I'm not from this time. I traveled here in a time machine from 20 years in the future. Really? From the future? That's incredible. Yes, Vegeta was right. Only he, yourself, and Gohan have Saiyan blood. I got mine from him. He's my father. What? You're kidding. I'll be born two years from now. Heh. <laughs> No kidding, Vegeta's gonna be a daddy. Now you're telling me, Goku. 
I didn't come here to tell you that. I have to talk to you about something. In three years, on the morning of May 12th at 10 a.m., two powerful entities will show up on a, a Menbo Island. They have dreadful power, even by our standards. They're monsters, Goku. Once they show up, the Earth, everything you know, be gone for good. What's the deal? Are they aliens? No, they're both androids. Uh, I mean cyborgs, created right here on Earth. Their creator is Dr. Jiro, the master behind, mastermind behind the Red Ribbon Army. Do you remember? You're gonna regret not taking him down, Goku. Yeah, I defeated him. You mean he lived? Thanks to you. Look, I'm sorry to say that, Goku. I know you're a good person who uh, hands out mercy, but letting Dr. Jiro escape was a mistake that'll come back to haunt you. Yep. It's probably been, he's probably working on those androids as we speak. I'm still not sure where his lab is. Uh, what time are we at? Ooh, man. Well, just in case, I'm gonna save right here. We may not be able to get this all in this episode, but, uh, let's see here. There we go. I'll try to finish it, though. If I knew, I'd pay him a visit instead of you. You defeated Frieza in a flash, and yet from what you're saying, these androids are even stronger than you. They are, Goku. Hunting me down is one of their favorite hobbies. But it's two against one, so there isn't much I can do besides run. What? What about the others? Aren't they helping you in the future? Uh, three years from now, the Z Fighters and Earth Special Forces will be wiped out. I'm all that's left, Goku. Piccolo is gone, and without him, the Dragon Balls are gone as well. So there's no chance of reviving anyone from using a wish. Uh, wait a second, Trucks. What happened to me? Did they defeat me as well? No, Goku. Not too long from now. You're gonna catch a new virus that attacks the heart. You won't survive it. You and the androids never even battle. What? What a bummer! Being killed by some stupid virus, I wanna fight these androids. I didn't even get a chance to take a crack at them. Yeah. You're a courageous man, Goku. I'm glad I came here. Here you go. Take this. It's for your health. Is it bacon flavored? Uh, yeah, sure. There's no cure for the virus, but in my time there is. Take this and you'll get sick for, and you'll be fine. Well, as long as it's not grape flavored, I don't like grapes. You're kidding me. That's awesome. And it's purple too. I bet it's bacon flavored. I shouldn't be doing this because it changes history. But, you know, some history should be changed, I think. And I'm glad, because my mother told me I could trust you. Your mother knows me? Uh, who is she? Bulma. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's a shock. Yeah. Quiet down, or they'll heal you, and I might ne not ever be born. Oh, sorry. Uh, Vegeta and Bulma are your parents. Wow. I don't remember my dad. So it's really great to meet him. He's a cranky guy, but he's impressive. Hey, whatever you do, don't mention to them this to them, otherwise I may never be born. But if you were never born, then you would never be talking to me. And we were never to be having this conversation. And uh why do I smell bacon? Alright. So that's basically yeah. The plot of the Android saga. Goku tells his friends about the warning from the future. I'm glad you did that off screen, saves us some time. And so we have three years to train. Aren't you excited, Go Go Gohan? Whoa, dude, that's hard to wrap your mind around. Say, Kakarot, why don't you explain how you escaped from Namek? Ah, uh, that's a great question. I'm sure that's gonna take some time, Vegeta. Uh, should I just continue this next time? Uh, maybe I should. That's kind of a good point to end it off right there. Um, well, guys, okay, yeah, let me save some uh, stuff here. And I'll save st state one. Okay, guys, so yeah. Uh, sorry to end it off here, but... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure my phone's about at the end, so... Next time, we'll uh, hear more from Goku and as far as how he escaped from Namek and uh, what else we need to do in this game. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for joining me. I uh, appreciate you guys watching these, and I'll see you guys all... 
next time on Dragon Ball Z. See you guys in. <laughs>